Xian Sheng Wu, also known as the First Lady of Physics and Queen of Nuclear Research, was born in a small town near Shanghai, China, in 1912. The second of three children, Wu studied at the National Central University, one of the oldest and most prestigious institutions of higher learning in China. Initially a mathematics major, she eventually switched to physics and graduated with top honors. After graduation, she spent two years doing graduate-level study in physics and also worked as an assistant at Zhejiang University. She then became a researcher at the Institute of Physics of the Academia Sinica. Encouraged by her mentor and supervisor to apply for her PhD abroad, she eventually decided to move to the United States and studied at the University of California, Berkeley. After completing her PhD in 1940, she and her husband moved to the East Coast where Wu worked at Smith College. After a few years, she accepted an offer from Princeton University as the first female instructor ever hired to join the faculty. In 1944, Wu joined the Manhattan Project at Columbia University, a research and development study during World War II that produced the first nuclear weapon. She helped to develop the process for separating uranium metal into the U-235 and U-238 isotopes by gaseous diffusion, producing large quantities of uranium as fuel for atomic bombs. After leaving the Manhattan Project, Wu spent the rest of her career in the Department of Physics at Columbia. It was there that she was approached by Sung Dao Li and Chen Ning Yang, two theoretical physicists who grew to question a hypothetical law in elementary particle physics, the law of conservation of parity. They eventually enlisted Wu's help, and she made history when she conducted an experiment that disproved the law of parity. This led to a Nobel Prize for the male physicists in 1957, but Wu was excluded, as were many other female scientists during this time. Aware of the gender-based injustice, a few years later she stated, I wonder whether the tiny atoms and nuclei, or the mathematical symbols, or the DNA molecules have any preference for either masculine or feminine treatment. In 1958, she was the first woman to earn the Research Corporation Award and the seventh woman elected to the National Academy of Sciences. She was also the first woman to serve as president of the American Physical Society. In 1965, Wu wrote a book, Beta Decay, which is still considered standard reading for nuclear physicists. In 1995, four fellow physicists founded the Wu Chen Sheng Education Foundation in Taiwan for the purposes of providing scholarships to young, aspiring scientists. Wu was a huge advocate for promoting girls in STEM and lectured widely to support this cause, becoming a role model for young women scientists everywhere. In 1998, she was posthumously inducted into the American National Women's Hall of Fame.